Here we're just going to tie a basic parachute. First thing you're going to do is lay down a uh, thread base. And the next thing we're going to do is we're going to tie in our tail. For this you're just going to use the hackle fibers from the uh, hackle that you're going to use later in the fly. You rip out a uh, fairly generous chunk of hackle fibers, maybe about 10 or so. And you want those to roughly be the length of the shank of the hook. You're just going to tie those in. Clean everything up. And the next thing you're going to do is you're going to dub the body. I like to just use super fine dubbing for my dry flies. It's a really fine dubbing. It floats very well. You put on just enough to coat the thread. Once you get towards the front of the fly there, near the thorax, we're going to tie in our parachute post. Here I'm just using some Antron. We're just going to tie that post in, equal amount sticking out on both sides. And you're going to draw the post up. You're going to take your thread and go around the post. Building up a little bit of like a chimney there. And you don't want to build it up too much, just uh about a millimeter or two. Now the next thing that we're going to do is we're going to measure out our hackle here. Make sure it's about the right length. We want it to be roughly, you want the barbs. I take them and I put them around the fly and you want them to stick out about as far back as the uh, body of the fly. You're going to peel off some of the hackle fibers so you get a, an exposed stem like so. Now what we're actually going to do is we're going to tie in this piece of hackle just right in front of our post. And I'm actually going to take this and I'm going to wrap this hackle around our post. You'll see why I'm doing this here in a minute. And you could trim out the extra stem. Now what we need to do is finish dubbing the head portion of our fly. I'm just going to use the same, same dubbing here.
I'm actually going to dub up towards the head first, and I take it back to where we were tying in our hackle. Once I've done that, I'm actually going to take the entire fly, invert it on my hook, or on my vise, just like so. I take my thread and I just wrap it around that post. Now what we're ready to do is actually wrap our hackle. You just take that hackle. Just wrap it around your your little post. Now once you've done enough wraps there, what we're going to do is we're going to tie it off. And you do this by just taking your thread, wrapping underneath all those hackles. And next, you whip finish right over all those hackles. just like so. You can trim out your thread. And I'll put it back up to the normal position here to help show you what we're doing. Then next you're going to get in here and you're going to trim out the, uh, the stem. Sometimes you have a few trapped fibers too. So I trim all those out. This is a much easier and I think quicker way to tie a parachute than the uh, traditional method. There's one stubborn guy in here. Once you've done that, you can actually trim your post here, just like so. And that's all there is to a parachute.